Uh, we just received a horrible news. Nigeria legendary movie superstar, Nollywood movie superstar, Mr. Ibu just passed. The news is not yet confirmed, but it's all over social media. People are already wishing him safe journey to the other side. People are already wishing him rest in peace. May Mr. Ebu continue to rest in peace. He was among my childhood. Like, I grew up listening to watching Mr. Ebu. You know, he made my life really, really easy for me growing up with uh, feeling at my face with so much smiles and laughter despite being hungry and hungry despite the economy hardship or maybe after they beat me in class listening to mr abel or watching mr abel makes me really really happy you know it's among those few superstars uh legendary superstar from nollywood that really really grew up that made this nollywood become what it is today his uh contribution and his love to make people laugh and so many things he has done will never be forgotten. He's a legend. And we know all the tribulations he has been going through. And how Nigerians really came through for him. Supported him. Donated for him. Despite the hardship. Despite what we saw with his family. And how they tried to undermine Nigerians for their contributions. And everything. I do not want to start talking all those things. I just hope that he got the best quality uh, health care before he passed. It's not as if. I just hope they gave him everything. You know, it was just nothing that they could do. Nigeria donated. Nigeria did a lot for him. Nigeria gave him a lot. Supported him wholeheartedly. So many, many things Nigeria did for Mr. Abu. And they, keep, they kept doing until the day it passed and again to the wife and to the family and to the daughter adopted daughter or to the son all those rumors that have been going around i just hope you guys are happy now the man has gone mr abel had a lot of uh a lot of uh, fault also that i also blame him for but you know he's gone and uh, we have to pay him that respect for the contribution he has done and it was so man, it's extremely painful, man. It's extremely, extremely, extremely painful. It's extremely pain, painful. I wish the family all the best. I hope they can come together and straighten things up. You know, now the man is gone and uh, we're quite ready as Nigerians to hear all sorts of fighting over money and over properties from the adopted daughter to the sons and to the uh, to that his wife for her children you know of course his wife as well the rest is sure you will be hearing the 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 story about property and everything really really soon but let us for now pay the hotmi respect to mr abel may god forgive him his sins may god forgive him uh, his trespasses and if god see him through may god uh, embrace him and so many other fallen heroes as well who made our life easy for us who made us smile, who made us happy. Not those wicked ones who made our life really miserable for us. Mm -hmm. So guys, uh, just to uh, pay a little bit tribute to Mr. Ebu, I'm going to play some of his video that we love. And uh, as you watch, try as much as possible to leave your your last respect. Well, I do. Now, they say, the news says Mr. Ebu's wife arrested Jasmine and Mr. Ebu's first son and his second son. Because you understand, this is the reason she said they should give her, they should print out bank statements so that she'll know the in and out of all the money. And secondly, they should carry everything and give it to her to take care of her. Secondly, she arrested them because she said Jasmine moved 300 million naira from the money when the public contributes. So, the money where we don't contribute, don't read 300 million naira. And we are not talk, we are still let people they contribute. Secondly, if Jasmine removed 300 million from the money where people contribute, that is to say that money don't reach like 500 million. Do you understand? We sickness where Mr. Ebu won't get, where 500 million off he take care of him. Unless if 
as the money they come, when I see they gather on, they, when they chop the public, when I won't use our money, take flex. So they won't even buy a house. Because for Jasmine to come on that money now and say she won't buy a house, that means they won't buy a house with the money. Now, what am I trying to say? To so the general public, I will advise you people, especially my own followers, do not contribute one nera for Mr. Ibu again. They have enough money. They have enough money. So as of now, the way they, they drag the money, now, if you say the money don't do plenty, everybody won't collect their share for the family. Now, here's the thing I want to say here. Yeah. This Mr. Ibu, where they talk about, that Mr. Ibu still there for sick bed. Nobody say the man don't come out. He never do okay. They sick bed. And the family, they drag money, especially the wife. When I was saying it earlier that, you see this woman, so I know they should say this woman really care about that man. And the money now in this woman, they have to, everybody won't chop me raw. You understand? Why will you say that about the woman? Why are they taking his wife out of the, 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 the? Now, the woman don't go arrest the man's sons. His type of own children. He don't go arrest them. All because they don't give you access to the money. Why do you need access to the money that the general public contributed for the well-being of your husband? I am still curious. But then again, if I talk, they say black, they put out of family matter. This same family matter, when I choke my mouth, use my platform, they beg people, make they contribute money. Hmm? This same family matter where we say all of us are carrying myself go to the hospital. I even send my hard earned hundred thousand naira. Beg my followers, please, even if it's hundred naira, two hundred naira, fifty naira, so when I don't gather all those money now. I don't reach over three hundred million. I don't go buy a house. When I don't the drag, when I they arrest to myself. To the public, don't contribute any money. To the people that have contributed so far, the people who have contributed money before, um, don't worry. Even though your money look as if you don't go in vain. I just want to pray for you. You understand that money, God go replace him, and you go get in ten thousand for God bear us witness, and God bear me witness. Say now out of the abundance of my heart, now at least one. And I do a lot of you too. You people did it because you care. You understand? Now to cut the long story short and to sum this whole thing, as of today, I will never open my mouth. Mm. I think go do one later in the future. But for now, I know they help anybody open my mouth. They use my platform. They say contribute for this person. This person have this problem. Because see that J Boogie too. They don't catch that one. That boy where go do BBA. That's boy where go do BBA. We're saying in get any problem. Say me they contribute, me they help and where they cry. They don't catch that one saying they lie. You understand? So it be like saying that the new format. So to the general public, I beg, I don't come on hand for any to do with contributing money for people again. Because it be like saying that so they want to chop money. And also do not contribute one naira for Mr. Ibu again. They have plenty money. If 500 million, I be 300 million, no fit take care of Mr. Ibu. I don't know what if you take care of him again. Their family have enough money. Don't contribute one naira to the out of Mr. Ibu again. That's all I can say. I did tell my own followers. Oh, and to my followers, anywhere where you say they won't contribute money for them, advise them. Say, ah, don't contribute again. Oh, they have plenty money. Oh. You understand? I tell you now. And I know the year. It's all about money for that woman. But everybody say, no, you people will learn. Sentiments, you people will learn. And you people will learn the hard way. It is always the hard way. You people will learn. Don't play. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is a live video of Mr. Ibu, as they called John Ikechuku Okafo and his wife, Stella Maris. Ibu yes. Res Okafo. We are here to let the public know that all the things they have been saying on social network and media is fake. I want you people to listen to Mr. Ibu John Ikechukwoka for, for him to tell you. Hey, his well. mm -hmm. So people have sold me like this. I only want to hear from from me. All they do is to sell me free of charge. The devil. It won't work. Mm -hmm. God has risen me up. God has risen me up. Amen. Mm -hmm. The wife? I'm Amen. here with my wife. Good. Mm -hmm. Look at her. She's here, life and direct. This is no rumor. I know they knew we had the beginning for the money. I'm not saying that all my friends. You are supposed to pay me a visit and give me money and not give me. Yes. They can give me no problem. Mm. But not as critical as they are talking now. For anybody whose business is to criticize my sickness and take advantage of it, I should stop. It's too much. It was.
I can walk now. He can walk very Plus well. That I cannot run. Exactly. 